I was very bored, so I asked people on Twitter to ask me questions. And here's the Halo related questions or streaming related questions. Um, I'll probably do the rest in another video. I'm not too sure yet. If you have any questions, just leave them in the comments, I guess, or follow me on Twitter, ask me on there. Okay, here we go. So the first question is, what got you into speedrunning, and how many times have you completed Halo 3? Well, as for what got me into speedrunning, uh, I lost internet for about a year. So I was just playing Halo 3 over and over again, since it was one of my favourite games at the time. Uh, and then when I got the internet, I ended up searching for speedruns. Since that's basically what I was doing, and I found out I was okay at it, so I started running it seriously, and I got a few records. As for how many times you completed Halo 3, it's a lot. Um, I played the game, I used to do about two no reset runs a day, every day for like a year. So, it's got to be close to a thousand, maybe over. It's a lot of times. Next question is, when is Halo 3 non-segmented? Uh, so if anyone doesn't know what that is, it was a project where a group of Halo 3 speedrunners were trying to complete Halo 3 uh, checkpoint by checkpoint as fast as possible. But recently, with the discovery of DZ clipping, uh, that's been cancelled now. So Halo 3 non-segment is never coming. I assume it will be back if we ever get Halo 3 or MCC for PC. But don't hold your breath for it. Next question is, what's your favourite Halo record of all time since the day you started? Um, I don't usually like individual level speedruns, but my favourite is Crow's Nest. Even more than my full game. Since that took a lot of months of grinding. That's probably the most amount of time I've put into a speedrun other than Halo 3 full game. I mean... I've also got all those ODST records, but that's, that's a shit game. Next question. What's your plans with streaming slash YouTube slash speedrunning now that DC launching has effectively overpowered Halo 3 runs? Uh, I've said this to other Halo 3 speedrunners. I'm not sure if I've said it anywhere else, but if DC clipping becomes a big thing in Halo speedrunning at the moment, we only really do it in one place, which is on the storm. Uh, if it becomes a big thing, I'll probably quit speedrunning. Um, at least full game. Uh, I'm not sure if I'll speedrun anything else, but yeah, I'll still continue making videos on YouTube. I don't really put much effort into them. But, um, yeah, quit speedrunning Halo 3. Do you ever see yourself expanding into another game speedrun predominantly? No, I want to run other games. I won't be taking them as seriously as I did Halo 3 though. I want to learn Badger because we're not some bolts next, I think. Uh, there's a lot of other games I want to learn, but that's probably next on the list. But at the moment, I'll still be running Halo. Next question asked by Heroic Rob. If I get a very good time on ODST, let's say like a 114, will we still run the game for an even better time? Uh, first of all, I really think ODST is a bad speedrun. I don't think there's many Halo runners that would say that ODST makes a good speedrun. Um, so, no, I probably won't go back to it. The only reason I went back to it last time was because a couple of speedrunners asked me to take the world record. So I did. Um, so I don't see me running ODSC again. Not anytime soon, at least. Final question, what is my opinion on Halo 5? Uh, the campaign is shit. Multiplayer is okay. 